Hi, let's get started with N4K, an enterprise version of Caverno built for enterprises. First thing that we'll need to do is add the Helm repository corresponding to the chart. We'll then need to update and pull the chart so that it's available to us. The next thing, after pulling the chart, we'll need to make sure that we get the images that are appropriate for this chart and mirror those into our own enterprise registry. As you can see here, I have a Harbor registry that's running internally that has the necessary images and their tags mirrored into them. So we're ready to proceed with the installation of N4K. From there, N4K is as simple to install as another Helm chart. Here you can see that we're setting the repository for those images that are located in our internal registry. Now that the chart has been installed, let's watch the Caverno pods and ensure that they're coming up successfully. Now we see Caverno has entered a running state and we can proceed to add some Caverno policies and test its functionality. Installing the Caverno pod security standard policies is yet another Helm chart, and they've been conveniently packaged together. And here we're able to set the validation failure action to enforce, which will block any pods that are in violation of any of those policies from the restricted profile. So let's install this chart now. Now that the policies have been installed, let's get them and make sure that they're in a ready status. With the policies ready, let's now test them by trying to create a pod which violates one or more of these policies and see what Caverno does. And here you can tell that Caverno has detected a bad pod and blocked it by citing not only the policies, not only the rules, but the reason why the pod has been blocked. And this concludes the demo of N4K.